What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button and be notified for future readings. This is free general collective reading for all signs. Caps through the statue, everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with the rest. Free general collective reading. Love you guys so much. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess 205. The link's in the description box below. PayPal only, no cash at my Venmo. Thanks for all the recent donations. Thanks for all the recent subscribers. If you'd like to book a personal reading, the information is in the description box below and offer new service as well. If you'd like to read up on that in the description box below as well. Okay, so I received this download about three times today. And I mean, not I'm not saying downloads are trivial, but I was just like, what? What? But I've received it three times today. So I'm gonna put it out there. Um my goodness, three times. That's triple confirmation. So I'm going to do it, okay? Um, and I'm not calling any downloads trivial, but I mean, it's not It's not like the other day when I got the daggum building, a huge, large building was going to blow up and somebody, one of my, um, one of my subscribers, it sounds like, is going to be in the building uh, and one is going to be near it. I mean, it's not like something like that or huge natural disasters. Uh, it's, I'm just saying. So, but I got it three times. So we're going to do it. I hope everybody's doing well. Okay, so um, the channel message I received was a Libra, and there's at least two of them, uh, Libra energies. One is dark side and one is light side. I heard that specifically. One is dark side and one is light side. So dark arts, dark arts wielder, past or present, not dark arts wielder. Uh, might be a reformed dark arts wielder for some of them, but not a no dark arts here. But one is, um, through many series of chain events, they're going to contact for a personal reading. I heard it's many different people. So I think the reason I'm getting this so much is because you guys might be the ones they're about to contact for personal readings. And there's sounds like there's at least two of them in the universe. But I think... The reason I'm getting this so much is because you guys might be the ones that are about to contact for personal readings. One is on the dark side, one is on the light side. So I don't know how you guys do it, but I screen energy before I accept or decline the readings. If I feel the energy's off, I decline the readings, the personal readings. Um, or if my spirit, spirit, my spirit, my spirit guides tell me not to do the reading, I decline the reading. Um, and of course, I'm very honest and upfront with my clients. Um, and I've made it very publicly known that I have the right to refuse personal readings. But my point is, one of them's dark side. So whoever is the dark side Libra is about to come contact you for a personal reading, it's going to be important to be on your spiritual game, your intuition high. Of course, you could accept the reading from this person, the dark side one, but that's never a good idea because that's energy... Sometimes dark side people accept readings, one, to spy on others, and two, to siphon energy from light side readers. So if you're one of the ones about to get consulted for a personal reading from a dark side Libra and masculine or feminine Libra, I'd be careful. They might try to energy share off of you, or they might energy share off of you, so I'd be careful, okay? But for one, it's a light side Libra. So just make sure you have your spiritual game on point, deciphering energy. Before you accept or define the reading. That would be my advice. You can take your leave. There's a reason I've gotten this three times today. Okay. Um, I heard for um, the light side one. Um, it's going to go very well between the reader and the um, and the light side Libra. And I heard for some of these Libras. They have gotten readings from you before. And they want to come back. For the light side ones. For the dark side. They have gotten reading from you before too. But there is a strategic reason why they're coming back. And I heard they will pay well. So I feel this is a spiritual warning for somebody out there with the dark side one. Now for the light side one, your previous client. They're, I'm sorry, they are previous client of yours. They are previous client of yours. Apparently you have helped them in some shape or fashion in the past. They want another reading from you. I heard it's been very well, very copacetic between you and them. And it sounds like it's going to go very well and very copacetic for you and them. Um. If you accept the reading again from them, but previous client energy in both of these situations, 
But this person, I heard they're going to pay very well or offer very well. But there are strategic reasons why they're trying to get this reading from you. So somebody needs to be careful. I didn't hear specifically how much they're going to offer for this reading. I know a lot of you guys have your prices posted very publicly on your business page. So I don't know. But I heard they're going to offer really well for this reading. There's a reason they're going to. So somebody needs to be careful on this one. And I'm just being serious, okay? This one I heard is going to go really well, and it's a previous client too. Both Libra energies, masculine or femme, they could have Libra in any aspects of their charts. Coming, I feel to a lot of my people for readings. Now, I, I know a lot of my subscribers are public speakers, popular online social media public speakers, popular online social media public platforms. A lot of you guys are. So somebody needs to be careful with this one. Not, not with this one. Just make sure your spiritual game's on point, okay? When you decipher and accept or decline personal readings. Of course, you can take the advice or leave, okay? I'll pull a couple cards and see if I hear anything else. That's basically the channeling I receive. Um, and we'll see if we get anything else on this, okay? One of these dark side people is about to get surrounded by news people. Surrounded by news people. It is about to freak them out so bad. They're about to decline and run. And then they're coming to the spiritual realm. Know this. Oh my God. Whoa. I've been pulling in a lot of news in here recently. A lot. So just for one of them. Not not all of them, but there's a mixture of light, there's a, mi a mixture of dark. But for one of the dark, I don't know if they're going to tell you. I feel I'm getting this because a reader is about to get purveyed for their services. That's what I'm feeling here. <laughs> but you plug it in, how it resonates. But for one of them, I don't know if they're going to tell you they're about to get basically surrounded and um, hoarded. Well, not hoarded, but surrounded by all these news people. Um, I don't know if they're going to tell you this uh, to try to get the reading, but they're going to try, they're going to offer you really well for it. I think it's that same person. It might be a different one, but one of them is going to get surround. They're going to be, it sounds like they're 3D about to get news people. Hey, can I ask you a question? Hey, is it true? Blah, 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 blah. Can I ask you blah, 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 blah. Like with the news crew right there. And it sounds like a lot of them. I heard it's about to freak them out so bad. It sounds like they're going to decline and run. And then I heard they're going to come to the spiritual realm. Somebody needs to be careful of this one. I'm serious. Yeah. Oh, my God. Spirit messages you have collected. I feel this is a spiritual warning for somebody out there. A reader. It definitely is for a reader. Oh my God, that's confirmation. It definitely is for a reader. That's confirmation, man. It definitely is for a reader. Somebody needs to be careful. Keep your spiritual game on point. Um, you have remember you have the right to refuse readings as a business owner. You have the right to refuse. You guys. Oh my lord, this is a hot mess express. I mean, with that one person. With that one person. At least one person. Spirit messages you have collected. And I feel they're going to offer, they're going to pay you, offer to pay you very well. It might be a different person or it might be the same. Oh my God, you can't make this shit up even if you wanted to. Energy, I think they're going to try to siphon energy from a personal reading and pay very well for it. I think their energy is declining. I heard they were on the dark side, dark energy, energy siphoning from a light side reader. Somebody needs to be careful. I mean, this, you can't make this crap up. Number 17 could be a very significant number of one's life. Number 17, energy. Energy harvesting. But a lot of you know this person does this. 
It would be smart to refuse the reading. Refuse the reading. There you go. I heard known energy harvesting. So I think she's gotten reading, um, he or she, I didn't hear it as a he or she. He or she has gotten readings from you a lot, whoever you are, whoever this dark side leaper is, masculine or feminine, energy harvesting. So they get, they pay really well for these readings for energy harvesting. Um, I heard it be smart to refuse the reading and I heard it big, refuse the reading. Now, of course you can listen to spiritual downloads or not, but I heard refuse the reading. Of course you can have free will to accept the reading, but I wouldn't. I pulled energy out of all these cards, you guys. For one reader, they're really trying to dabble in your energy and it's about to backfire on them in a huge way. Okay, for one of these dark sides, they're trying to dabble in your energy in a huge way and it's about to backfire on them. So they're trying to play in your energy, dabble in your energetic space. That's a spiritual no-no. That's breaking a spiritual law for anybody who doesn't know that. Uh, and it's about to backfire on them. Well, it should. And that's just the truth. That's a spirit. That's breaking spiritual laws, dabbling in people's energy. Who might doesn't know that. Let's pull one more. Let me see if I hear anything on this for the light side or any other messages. There's about to be a very significant electrical fire soon and an electrocution that someone's going to talk about during a personal reading. Red flag. Someone needs to hear this. Oh my God. There's about to be a very significant electrical fire and an electrocution that somebody's about to talk about during a personal reading. That's a huge red flag. That's what I heard. I will hopefully you can pick up on the negative energy and you don't even accept the reading. I heard something about an electric, during a personal reading, something about an electrocution and a electrical fire. That's a red flag. So for one of you readers, there's somebody, it sounds like, oh, about to get a personal reading from you and they're going to talk about some kind of electrocution and electrical fire. I heard that's a red flag. So whoever you are, um, readers, I feel this is for the readers. If somebody starts talking about an electrocution and an electrical fire, that's a red flag. Think they're dark arts and they might be energy harvesting you or try, attempting to energy harvest you. Somebody needs to be careful. I heard electrocution and an electrical fire. All right, I'm closing this out. I, I'm closing this out. All right, I love you. I hope this helped and namaste.